Hi, Basmark here, and I'm happy to present you Wally 7, entirely made in the digital designer. So, I started off by just wanting to do parts of it and ended up doing the whole thing for your enjoyment, whether or not you venture into building this one maybe you can get some pointers on how I actually built it so I am actually uh, had a lot of fun doing this it was more uh, enjoyable than I thought it would be so I just kept on going until it was all done it's really fun to uh, see the uh, robot and all these angles Now there's a few things like the tracks I haven't wrapped around because that's just like insane work but I think the essence is there or the door the door doesn't fit because that touch sensor is sticking out and so I can't snap it in place things like that but here's how it works I, I've made all the different sections in separate LDD files and then you go into template and you create template from selection and then all the templates actually remain across different projects so you know I made the arms in one file but then created templates and then you see I can drag an arm in here now okay well it doesn't work because it's memory extensive but anyways so that said um, each time you create a template you can also create groups and now I can move around in the general file all these different elements so here's the first part I made and the motor motor section here for the door we got the door we got the front legs the front motor back motor which is over here in the back and the back legs and then you have one arm and the other arm and the whole tracks and the head and the neck and the remote so you made the remote so that's pretty cool I've actually modified it from my original design I'm now using the uh, four of the EB3 sensors, whereas before this this little switch here was using a NXT sensor, but I wanted to make it all EB3, so I modified it. And voila. Now I'm going to share this file so you can go ahead and play with it yourself. I've actually put all the cables too, so that's pretty cool. Spent a little bit of time doing the cabling. It's it's a nice documentation. I've never done such work on any of my large robots before. I know Robin Day had made a uh, PDF file, building instructions for Wally 4. Zwali, he was called. Zwali 4. So those exist, but not for any of those transforming robots so that's pretty uh, pretty neat so now that we've got this digitally made we can go into <coughs> sorry we can go into space and we all know what happens in space eh? so let's check this out this is always the fun part going in space space I'm lost in space Ooh. Ooh. Okay, and the moment we've all been waiting. Oops. Whoa, 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 whoa. Like this. Click. Come on. My mouse is stuck. Seriously? Okay. The moment we've all been waiting for the explosion. That's pretty cool. I love how the tracks just make 
That's really neat. Let's try it again. An explosion. So thanks for watching. Check out my webpage. I've redesigned it. Basmart.ca. Uh, from there, you can get links to everything, Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, everything. So there you go. By the way, this robot is going to be in Qatar. Ah, what am I saying? This robot is going to be in India for WRO. Uh, in a few days, I'm leaving, and uh, you'll be able to see this robot live. Probably the last time I'll bring him to an event, so he's going to be retired after. Another fun reason why I've got now a nice LDB file of it. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching and see you next time.